1954 Ford F100, all caged, small block Chevy Camaro subframe, five speed, nine inch Ford, all new rear fenders, new running boards, all new glass, glass tilt nose, Needs the poppers installed, haven't installed them yet. As you can see, it's all caged. The inside is done in uh, Plum Crazy. All the jams. Vintag, fire extinguisher, tilt column, five speed. All your gauges, tack, new fuel tank, three inch exhaust all the way. Stock nose on it, just a glass nose with the stock grill and headlights. All the lights work, everything works. The truck is on the road. I've been building this truck for a couple of years now. Has a brand new 350 LT1 crate motor in it. Again, five speed, new clutch, new pressure plate, new throw out bearing, hydraulic clutch, new slave cylinder. I'm gonna pause for a second and open the hood. Okay, two pins, pops the hood. One finger, lifts it up. As you can see, Camaro subframe, power disc brakes, new 350 crate motor. You can see down there, I don't know if you can see the tag is still on it cross flow radiator and you can see the truck is tied together here tied to the front frame and go on the other side and you can see the power booster you can see the slave for the clutch all new motor mounts drive shaft loop new drive shaft new U joints line lock new flamethrowers Three inch exhaust, power steering, I'm going to just start it up now, make sure it's in neutral. As you can hear, no noises. As I'm sure you can hear, it definitely has the deep throat tone. Like I said, three inch exhaust all the way out, glass packs. If I look under here, you can see uh, the spark plugs for the flamethrowers. And uh, that's about it, I think. Good luck bidding, everybody.